Welcome back to the Moran family. It feels so good to finally say that. I don't know if I'm officially back on YouTube. I mean, I may be posting videos like here and there, but I don't really have like a set schedule. I'm kind of just going with the flow because as you guys know, there's just so much going on, but I don't really want to talk about it in this video because I don't know that I'm really I guess ready to kind of talk about everything but there will be a life update going up i don't even know <laughs> but you guys can be on the lookout for a life update and when i'm ready i will sit down and film that and kind of talk to you guys about everything going on because if you've been keeping up with our family then you know there's a lot going on including we just bought our first house and it's so exciting so the other day I went to Target and Ross and I bought a whole bunch of home stuff. So I want to keep this video pretty like light and fun. So I'm going to just do a home haul with you guys. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys is a comforter set. So this is for the girls room. I have two of them, but I'm literally filming on top of one comforter set. Like the camera is on top of the comforter set right now. Don't have a tripod, so I'm working with what I got. But anyways, I got two of these. So it is by the brand Room Essentials from Target. It's like a peach color. I don't know if the camera is fully picking it up. And then, I don't know if you guys can tell, but it does have like that really fluffy Sherpa material. I feel like I'm saying that wrong, but I'm sure you guys know what I mean. So to go with their comforter, I ended up getting them some sheets too. So I got two packs and it matches the comforter really, really nicely. This is also by Room Essentials. And again, it's just a microfiber twin size sheet. So I got two of those, one for Lei, one for Aurora. I ended up getting two blankets. They are Halloween themed. I'm already in the Halloween spirit. I'm in the fall mode already. So when I saw these, I had to pick them up and they were cheap. They were like nine dollars these are both from ross so this is the first one it's white and then it has pumpkins on it it's kind of like a teal bluish color going on that's another question that i get all the time what colors are we doing in the house so the walls and the flooring in our house is pretty much gray and then it has like white trimming all around so we're gonna kind of keep the house neutral in a way so everything is going to be like gray, black, and white for the most part. But then we're going to have like pops of this color. So I thought this throw blanket would look really, really nice on our couch. And then Layla begged me for this blanket, so I got it for her. This one was cheaper than the other one. The last one was like $9. This one was 7 So I ended up picking this one up for her. This one just screams Halloween to me. It has like a bunch of cats on it and a bunch of dogs and they're dressed up in Halloween costumes. So it's so cute. I ended up picking up this basket. Originally, I wanted this for Everly's plant. After she was born, we were gifted a peace lily plant and I really, really want to keep it alive, hopefully for years to come. It just means so much to me and we call it our little Everly plant and it just brings us so much joy. So I'm trying to keep it alive. If you guys have any tips on caring for peace lilies, definitely let me know down below in the comments because I really just want to keep it around for years, hopefully. But I ended up buying this basket to put like the pot in it. So that way it goes like with our house theme and everything. But I didn't do measurements, of course, because I'm lazy and I just... I didn't get measurements so this basket is actually too big so I'm probably going to go ahead and order another one and downsize but I think since this one is too big and I'm not going to use it for Everly's plant I think I'm just going to have this like in our home somewhere and then throw all of our cat's toys inside of it and yes we do have a cat if you guys go back and watch like my old videos on my channel then you guys will see him his name is Thor but you guys haven't seen him in any videos because you guys know I've been living at my mom's for the past like, I don't know, five months or something. And then he had to ship out here. So he's currently staying with one of our family members. I ended up getting like this, what do you even call this? I don't know. But it's like liners for our cabinets in the kitchen. Just because I don't want like our mugs and everything to get scratched up in our cabinets. So I'm going to line all of the cabinets in our kitchen with this. It's just gray, just boring. In our house, we have two bathrooms. One is for the girls and then one is 
for me and Ben. So for the girls' bathroom, the color scheme that I'm going with is like pastel colors. I ended up getting this towel. This was $6.99 from Ross. And then I ended up getting the matching two hand towels. And these were on sale for $3 each. I ended up getting the last ones or else I would have just picked up a lot more than what I got. Then to match with that, I ended up getting this bath rug set. So it comes with two bath rugs. So one for like under the sink and then one by the shower. This was $15.99 from Ross. I wasn't able to find them a shower curtain, unfortunately, that matched. So I'm going to have to go on like Amazon or something because I checked Target and I couldn't find anything at Target. And then for our bathroom, I ended up getting this rug, which I am so obsessed with. I think it's so pretty. It was $14.99 and it's like gray and white, but then it has like tassels all down the bottom. So I thought it was so cute. Again, it comes with two, one large one and then one smaller one, but I just think this is so pretty. So this is going in our master bathroom. And then to go with that rug, I ended up finding this shower curtain, which I think matches pretty, pretty good. I think so. Yeah, I think it matches pretty good. So this is the shower curtain that's going to go with that. Rug is from Ross and then the shower curtain is from Target. So that's what it looks like. Kind of has like a tribal print going on. Um, Target, because I couldn't find the right color gray towels from Ross. So I ended up getting the hand towels from Target. And these were, let's see the tag, but I want to say these were around like $6 each. So a little bit more than the ones from Ross, but like I said, I couldn't find the perfect gray color that I wanted. For our kitchen, we needed a dish rack. So I just got a basic dish rack for now. So this is again by the Room Essentials line from Target. That's what it looks like. It is collapsible. So this is what it will look like once it's all set up. I ended up getting this plant from target i've been so obsessed with plants i kind of want to do real ones in the house but i'm scared because i've never really taken care of a plant and i have everly's plant right now that i'm trying to take care of keep it alive so i feel like one plant right now is good for me and i really want to focus on her plant i had so many pretty plants at target eventually i want to have a whole bunch of plants around the house but for now i just picked up this one and this one is originally $29.99, but I got it for $8. So if you're looking for fake plants for your house, definitely head to Target because they have a huge sale going on right now. Because I think they're getting rid of like all of their summer stuff and they're bringing in their fall stuff. Because the thing I got is like a utensil holder, just a basic silver one. This was also on sale. I just got a laundry basket. This was on sale for $3 and it's in like a really pretty peach color. The last two things I ended up picking up is bedding for mine and Benny's bed. So I ended up getting a quilt set and this is by the brand Casual Comfort. It's cotton and it's just all plain gray, but it has like stitched in. It has like this really pretty floral print. I don't know if you guys can tell on the picture, but it does have like flowers on it, embroidered in it. So it's nothing too crazy or girly. I didn't want to get anything too crazy because I'm sure I'd drive Benny nuts if I got like a super pink comforter or something. So with our quilt, I ended up getting some sheets and then it just comes with two pillowcases. It's just gray as well, but it's kind of a darker gray than that one just to kind of give our bed a little bit dimension i originally wanted to get white sheets but i couldn't find them so for now this is going to just work both of these are from ross this one was 19.99 and then i want to say this quilt set was like 40 dollars. that is everything that i ended up getting for our house i'm so excited to finally be able to move in I don't think I'm going to be moving in just yet because I am like two weeks postpartum. So I'm still like, I still can't carry Rory. And until I heal and I feel good, then I will officially move in with Benny. But for now he is there, he's unpacking, which I feel bad for because he, I feel like he's been doing this move 
by himself it's kind of like a house update everything is still all crazy there's so much going on if you guys enjoyed this home haul and if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up make sure you guys are subscribed to the man family and make sure you hit that bell so that way you guys always get notified every single time we upload super important that you guys turn on our notifications because like i said our schedule is all over the place really quickly i just wanted to say thank you guys so much for your love your support and your prayers as always your guys' comments bring me so much joy and they're just really helping me so thank you thank you times a million and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys you're my music but you tear me to pieces so where does it come from Keeps playing on repeat, ignores the